Well, we're here in the city of Manistee Fire Department. Our department has been here continuously manned with people in, living in the station since the doors opened up in June of 1889. So that means that there's been somebody here 24 hours a day, 365 days a year for the past 128 years. The station is very much as it was when it first opened up. There's been relatively few changes made to the overall structure itself. We've been fortunate enough to be able to take care of the station and keep it as it was intended by the people when they had it built for us. The firefighters, not just myself, but all the firefighters who came before me, have had a tremendous amount of pride both in the community and in the station and have gone through extraordinary efforts to keep it looking like it does. The station re remains pretty much like it did. All the pictures that you can see hanging on the walls here in the day room will show a clear representation that the station is basically unchanged. Still functions as a fire station just as it did back then. Guys still sleep upstairs. We have a kitchen, other work areas that we can use. Down here in the in what we call our day room, this is the more historical part of the station as far as what the general public sees. Great Fire 1871 happened, same time as the Chicago Fire, same time as the Peshtigo, Wisconsin Fire. Pretty much most of Manistee was burnt to the ground during that fire. Constantine Fleschner was responsible for not only for this station being built, but for this location being chosen. And even today, this location has proven to be very central as far as centrally located for response throughout the city. We have a three minute response time any place within the city. And it's served the community well for those 128 plus years. It's my belief that we are the oldest continuously manned station in the world. The reason for saying that is that there may be a lot of other physical fire stations, buildings throughout the world that are possibly chronologically older, but none have been around as long and served continuously as a fire department as our station has. 